what's up? Welcome back to another video. I'm your boy J Bird, aka Mr. Cool Guy. With this video, I'm showing you my full collection of the best hip hop albums of 2004, and I hope you all like this collection I got. I recently did an album review of T.I.'s fourth album, Urban Legend. Don't forget to check that out. And I gotta say, this album is one of the best albums of 2004. They got all the hits off here, such as You Don't Know Me, ASAP, and a few other singles, such as uh, Bring Em Out, and Get Loose, and Freak Though. That's why this album is such a classic, and I'm glad that I became a fan of this album. When I heard all the singles on the radio, and when my brother used to have this record, you all could tell me, like, is this one of the best albums y'all ever heard or not? Let me know your thoughts. <laughs> Eminem, Encore. Now, this album is dope. A lot of people say that this was his worst album that came out in 2004, but I think this album was one of his best albums that he done. They got a bunch of singles off here, such as, uh, Mock, Like Toy Soldiers, Just Lose It, Ass Like That, Mock and Bird, Crazy in Love, Eminem did good with this album, and it sold millions, and it went ten times platinum, and Dr. Dre produced, like, every track on, I mean, most of the tracks on this album. You all can tell me, like, is this one of Eminem's best albums in 2004 or not? Let me know your thoughts. I recently did an album review of this album by Tupac Khan. Riddle and Gaze with the Masterpiece. They got singles such as Dropping Like It's Hot. And the rest of the songs were dope. And you all can tell me, like, what y'all like about this album by Snoop Dogg. Y'all rate this one of Snoop Dogg's best albums in 2004 or not? Let me know your thoughts. Here goes Ludacris album, Red Light District. It's got songs called, it got songs come off this album such as Number One Spot, Get Back, Potion, and what's that one song I'm thinking of? Pim Pimping All Over, that's another single. Sing off the album, dipping all over the world. You walk into something like what y'all like about this album by Louis Chris. One of his best albums or worst albums. Y'all just like this. A dope album that came out in the year 2004. Let me know your thoughts. Nelly Sweat. This is his third album that was released in the year 2004. And he made another album at the same time. This album, it debuted at number two on the charts, but he did not get enough props, but he did have some interesting joints off here, such as Na Na, Flap Your Wings, Tilt Your Head Back, and it's good that he got like a lot of uh, Midwest hip hop coming together with like R&B, and Case the Rap, and Nelly did go with this record though. He go in there, uh, blew up the charts though, but he did build this record. Y'all can tell what John think of that album by Nelly. Is it one of his best works in 2004 or not? Let me know. Here go Nas' double album called Street Disciple. They got like singles off his. Bridge in the Gap, Virgo, American Way. And it's got like guest pieces from Ludacris, Busta Rhymes, Maxwell, Kesley, Doug G. Fresh, and many more. And I gotta say, Nas did go with this album with like all the gangsta rap, political rap, and East Coast hip hop. And you all can tell me what we all like about this album in the comments below. Is it one of his best albums or not? Let me know your thoughts. Lil Wayne, 
they help the Carter. And this is one of his best albums. Y'all yeah, like the singles on the album, such as Go DJ. This is a classic by Lil Wayne. He did good with this record. I don't care what nobody says. This is another dope album of 2004. Y'all can tell me what y'all think of it in the comments below. Let me know. That's whiter than Westbrook, you throw, the phantom, exterior like you say, the interior like Mace album walked back. He took a break from hip hop for five years. He came back with this album walking back. And Mace is another dope legend in the game. He's the piano of the P. Diddy's label. Bad boy. And I gotta say the single off the album such as Walking Back, Green Stretch Shake, and Keep It On. Those are the best three singles off this record, and the rest of the songs were dope though, but y'all can tell me like, this is one of the best albums that you ever heard that came out when it was the year 2004, y'all can keep it in. This job returning with this album, and he got enough props, and it's one of his best works that he done from his two other previous albums. Let me know your thoughts in the comments, what y'all like about this album by Maze. Jada Kiss. This is his third album. Kiss of Death. He got like six off here, such as Why Make Me Wanna. And I gotta say, this album is fire. I'm glad it went number one when it was the year 2004. And Jada did build this album. And it did. That's dope hits on here. And you walk into my like, y'all like about this album in the comments. And what a Jada, uh, best album that he did in 2004. Let me know. We go to the uh, fourth album by Nelly that came out the same year. That is third album, Sweat came out. And I gotta say, this album do got like a lot of uh, hip hop and RB. It's about 11 tracks on here, and he did good with all 11 tracks. You all can tell me like, what y'all like about this album in the comments book. Who wants to tell you the best album or not? Let's know your thoughts. This album is by Eminem D12. It's known as D12 World. The songs I like all here is My Band. The rest of the songs were dope though, but that's my favorite song off of uh, this album, it's my band, but they did go with this album, and then Vlad went number one, and it uh, went three times platinum, and walk and tell like we got like about this album by D12, this is one of the best albums in 2004, y'all just think the album is just ill, please share. Y'all can tell what y'all think of these albums. They the best uh, albums of 2004 because me, I like all the albums. I got more albums to add to uh, 2004 uh, era. But don't worry, more of those albums will be coming soon, though. I hope y'all like the albums that I got right now, though. Well, look, I'm your boy, Jay Bird, a.k.a. Coach Now with a 
ook best album collection of 2004. Y'all should tell like what y'all like about this album. What's the best album that came out? It really burned up the charts. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Peace out, y'all.